go back to Leviticus now. Back in Leviticus. Now, let, now understand something. Mm -hmm. I'm going to show you in the Bible. Holiness is the only belief mm -hmm. that don't have no date. No date on it. There's no other religion in the world that can say they was here before the world was. That's right. Islam can say it. Catholic can say it. Protestant can say it. Jehovah fakers that call themselves Jehovah witness can say it. None of them. None of them. Listen at what the Bible says. Leviticus 19 and we're starting at verse 1. All right. And the Lord spake unto Moses. You see, Moses that's what saying. big mind preaching so strong. The Lord speak. The Lord's talking. That's right. And I don't care how tough you are, you're not tougher than the Lord. No. Don't bring me nobody. Don't bring me Elijah Muhammad. Don't bring me some great grand dragon of some organization. Amen. Don't bring me a Harry Krishna. Don't, blame, don't bring me Medicare York. Don't bring me nobody. Nobody. Unless they match their steps with the Lord. The Lord. And if nobody can match their steps with the Lord, creator of heaven and earth and sustainer of the worlds, you better get far away from them. That's right. Who do you know that's bigger than the Lord? Amen. Who do you know that's better than him? Well, who do you know that's greater than him? And please tell me who's equal to him. Nobody. Are you listening? And the Lord spake unto Moses. And the Lord. Know ye the Lord, the Bible says, for he is God. He is God. The Lord spake unto Moses, saying, unto Moses, saying, Speak unto all the congregation of the children of Israel. And what shall we do? And say unto them, Ye shall be holy. Why? For I, the Lord your God, am holy. Now let's see how long it been here. Now in the book and of Ephesians. And what was God's purpose before the world was? That's right. In the book of Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 4. Follow me in the scriptures. Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 4. I don't want you to think I'm four. making up something. Amen. Many people comment over the air. They say all you do is shoot down religions. <laughs> I shoot down everything a man started. That's right. If it contradicts God, I'm not only going to shoot it down, I'm going to burn it up with the Bible. That's right. Why in the world would you be loyal to something that a man start that contradicts God? Amen. You mean to tell me you claim you're a believer in the scriptures? Are you more loyal to some man? Then you are God. God's people supposed to be loyal to him above everything. That's right. And what God does is bring you his thinking, his, thinking. his standard, his law, his precepts, and make you turn around his direction right. and make you turn your back on everything else. That's right. Hear me good. In the book of Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 4, according as he. Listen. Glory to God. Amen. According as he. As he. He, uh, he. 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 God. That's right. He who. God is one. That's right. According as, as he. Hath chosen us in him. In them. In him. No. God the Father. God the Son. And God the Holy Ghost. According as he hath chosen us in you him. You Trinitarian liars. That's right. We don't have no three supreme powers here. No. We have one supreme one. power. That's right. And God is he. That's right. There's no Bible that even says Jesus is the second person of the Godhead. No. There ain't no Bible reads like that. No. Nowhere. Nowhere. There is no Bible that says the Holy Ghost is the third person of the Godhead. That's the lie that Catholics told. That's right. That teaching originated in Rome. Amen. And it dropped in all the so-called Christian churches. That's right. That's why you see him. Got the Father. Got the Son. Got the Holy Ghost. Three, three, or one. And then I get you in a ring with the Bible and tell you three what? Three what? Three what? That's right. Well, Jesus is the second person in the Godhead. Read me that scripture in the Bible. Read that. You'll be searching through the Bible till Jesus come. That's right. And you will never find it. No. Holy Ghost is the third person in the Godhead. He's a third person liar. That's right. Holy Ghost means Holy Spirit. Spirit. Holy Spirit is an adjective. Spirit is God's nature and holy is God's character. That's right. There's only one that's the Holy Spirit and holy. God is he. That's right. Are you getting what I'm telling you? According as he has chosen us in him. According. 
as he has chosen us in him before the foundation of the world before when before the foundation of the world glory to God before before the world was that we should be holy no no we should not be holy we should be what we want to be that we should be holy Amen. And how strict is holiness? And without blame. What? And without blame before him in love. You smoking and drinking and gambling and living together, not married, and use a man switching like a woman. Mm. You ain't blameless. Not blameless. You're a racist. You're a prejudice. You're a bigot. You're not blameless. That we should be holy and without blame. Without blame. Before, without, without blame. Without blame. Without blame. You young men walking around the streets of Pittsburgh with your hand, your pants hanging down, showing your underwear like you's a Pittsburgh male hooker. That's right. Am I right, I said? Amen. Ain't no real man going to advertise his butt, but some man that's some, uh, you know, he's kind of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's right. You're walking around making a booty call to your neighborhood. Amen. Ain't no real man going to act like that. No, no. What did it say? That we should be holy and without blame. Without blame. Before him. Before him. Before How? In love. In love. Now in the book of Isaiah. Now chapter this 35. is the only teaching hmm. way in the scriptures. That's right. That the scripture says was here before the foundation before of the world. Before the foundation Listen, of the that world. go back past every prophet that ever walked earth. That's right. Every prophet that ever walked earth can't go back that far. Nobody. Nobody. You that's dedicated to a religion, when you research the history of it, you're going to find some man started it, you're going to find some date, and you're going to look at who are members of it, and that's some right. of you going to brag and say if this star is in it, this movie mm -hmm. star is in it, this multi-millionaire is in it, I don't care who's in it. <laughs> Amen. All I want to know is God and the prophets, mm -hmm. Jesus, the apostles, right. Are they in it? Are they in it? That's and right. they're in it, and they believe it, and they practice it. That's right. Then it's all right. Then it's all right. Otherwise than that, hmm. it's all wrong. That's right. This go back past Muhammad. Yes. This go back past Moses. Oh, yeah. This go back past every man that walked the earth. Back in Ephesians chapter 1 and verse 4. It says what? According as, According as he has chosen as us God in has him. God chosen us in him. Before, before the foundation of the world that we should be holy. Do you hear that? Amen. If the Jehovah Witnesses do that, they wouldn't knock on your door no more Saturday mornings. No, they wouldn't. Interrupting your fishing grits. That's right. Just to give you a comic book to believe a lie. That's right. That's right. God have never sent people out door to door to give out comic books to lead you to him. No. Just when did God use cartoons? Amen. To lead you to him. That's religious play. That's right. He's too real for such foolishness. That's right. Now, God's way. God's way. Holiness mm -hmm. is the standard of God. Yeah. Holiness, the teachings of God. That's right. Holiness, the thinking of God. That's right. Holiness, the ways of God, passed down from heaven, mm -hmm. given in the mouths of the prophets and the apostles. Mm -hmm that man may learn the characteristics of God through the teaching of God. That's right. You see, when God says, let us, you better give me Genesis 126 because multi-God believers love that scripture. Oh, yes. I mean, they love it. They say it right then. You see there, God was talking to a whole lot of other fellas. I was talking to some Mormons, and the Mormon belief is there's a council of gods in heaven. You know, like the Justice League. <laughs> That's right. That's how foolish and ignorant it is. They teach that Satan mm. and Jesus were brothers. Oh, Lord. You know that's so deep out of hell. Amen. It's so deep out of hell, I wonder how it got out. That's right. Satan and Jesus are brothers. Mm. And they said 
Satan and Jesus were sitting among a council of gods. Hmm. And the world was in such chaos, the council of gods supposed to say, well, hmm. being that the world is in such chaos, who should go out to the earth and straighten the earth out? Mm -hmm. And the Mormons, the so-called Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Aints, hmm. said that there was an argument. And Jesus said, I would go, and Lucifer said, I would go. And it was such a bitter disagreement, they said it was war in heaven. Mm. And the lot supposedly fell on Jesus, and Satan got mad with him and started a war in heaven. You see how man just come up with stuff? That's right. Anytime you're going to believe in a religion that's supposed to start it, being found in a rock, under a rock, in New York... <laughs> of all places. Of all places in New York. Amen. That allowed the founder to have over 50 something women for wives. That's right. And his partner in crime, Brigham Young. Yeah. Over 30 or 40 something partners uh, for wives. Mm -hmm. You know, men will love that religion. That's right. Because it has satisfied the flesh. That's right. God come along and send prophets out to warn the world about a highway shall be there. And a way. Listen at this. In the book of Isaiah chapter 35. And a one. highway, a way to travel, that's, a way to go. That's right. And God want everybody to get on this one way. That's it. It ain't one way for Pittsburgh, one way for Philadelphia, another way for Delaware, another way for the Midwest, another way for the West Coast, or the West Coast. Everybody got to be on the same way. That's right. That's the scriptural way. That's the scriptural Jesus way. came and chose 12 disciples, and they were 12 apostles he made them. Notice, all the apostles had the same thing. That's right. Not one, not one preaching differ from another. No. Even when Barnabas and Paul came on later, their teaching never contradict their brothers that had the truth before them. That's right. Whenever God sent the prophets, none of God's prophets had a revelation that was in contradiction of the God of heaven himself. That's right. How is it these men today? How is it? Got all this anointing that's supposed to be so powerful <laughs> and got more lies than anybody ever told. That's right. And what makes it so bad? The people love it. Oh, yes. Don't they? Oh, yes. The people love it. They flock to it. Even the sinner know this garbage that's going on under the heading of religion. God, church ain't got no business being like that. That's right. You folk go to church every Saturday or Sunday and smoke on the outside of the church. Mm -hmm. You can see people standing on the outside of the church smoking, lighting up pipe, asking Reb, do you got a match? That's right. Reb, the deacon and the trustee bought all smoking and drinking and you're still partying and lying and got bars in your house, drinking Jack Daniels, living together, not married, and every rotten thing under the sun. And then you go to church and think that pleases God. That don't please God. No, no. Anybody can go to church. That's right. Anybody can go to a mosque. And right. anybody can go to a synagogue. Amen. God wants obedience. That's it. If you ain't willing to obey him, stay home and go to hell from home. That's right. Am I right, I said? That's right. What did he say? Isaiah chapter 35 and at verse 8. What is it? And a an highway shall be there. What? And a an highway shall be there. Glory to God. Amen. A highway shall be there. Shall be there. And a way. No. And a A W A Y S. And a W A Y. One way. And a way. And it shall be called the way. Of what? Of holiness. Oh, no, no. 
The Bible call it that? And it shall be called the way of holiness. Well, look at you. You are the way of Baptist. <laughs> That's right. You are the way of Methodist. And you are the way of apostolic and Pentecostal and non-denominational and yeah. all of this other stuff and Trinitarian. And yeah. Everything. Everything. Everything that the scriptures don't say nothing about. That's right. You believe it. That's right. You practice it. Mm -hmm. Your family go to it. Amen. Raise up in it. And then when somebody come along like us and point you to the Bible and say, stop, Amen. stop, oh, yeah. detour, stop, right. wrong way. Yeah, just like some crazy drunken person that run, go down the wrong way of a neighborhood. That's right. They don't pay no signs, no mind. No mind. Well, a day coming, you're going to pay God some mind. Yes, you will. The whole world is going to pay God some mind. That's right. Let us be intelligent now. That's right. We done played stupid too long. <laughs> Amen. Do you really think the God of heaven left it up to the human race mm. to choose what they want to believe? No way. No Look way. at what the folks believe as a result of their carrying on. Yeah. Some believe you can have two wives. Yes. Some believe you can have four. Some believe you can have all you can and can all you can get. That's right. That's right. Some believe you can have five husbands, three husbands, two husbands. <laughs> Some believe women can preach. Oh, yes. Some believe women can be evangelists and bishops and elders. That's right. Got all type of beliefs. Some believe that, no, the only, the only ones that can be right is only white folk. Mm-hmm. The only ones that can be right is only black folk. There is a way which seemeth right. Do you hear? Do you hear what the word of God says? In the book of Proverbs chapter 14 That's why verse I love 12. the word of God because it tackles everything and everybody. That's right. You can go running down field with your religion under your arm like a football, but here come truth going to tackle you right down until you bite the dust. <laughs> That's right. Do you hear what the word of God says? Proverbs chapter 14 and at verse 12. What is it? There is a way. There there is a way which seemeth right unto a man. And what's the end of it? But the end thereof are the ways of death. Look at what you believe. Amen. That's right. Glory to God. Look at what you believe. That's it. See, do God believe it? Don't brag about it. Right. You gave money to some preacher. You bought him his car. Mm -hmm. You bought him his yacht. You bought him his home. You sent his kids to the best schools. That's right. I tell them, let the preacher go get a job or go to work or let him go to the grave starving. That's right. Are you listening? There is a way which seemeth right. It seemed right. Unto a man. What make it right? Not how many people believe it, how many people practice it. Do God believe it? That's it. Is God what you profess? That's it. That's right. That's what makes it right. That's what makes it Do right. Do God believe it? That's it. Hey Amen. When I debated the nation of Islam, <laughs> I was scheduled to debate one that day, and I ended up debating four in one day. <laughs> and he told me God created himself mm -hmm. from triple doctors. I said, really? God, God is self-made? Hmm. He said, yes. I said, what did God make himself from? Amen. God? God. Make himself mm. starting off as a speck of light, mm. spinning in space until he came into existence. <laughs> That's worse than a sci fi movie. That's right. The God of heaven don't have no beginning. No, no. The God of heaven don't have no ending. That's right. The God of heaven is without father. Yes. He's without mother. Without mother. Always was, always has been. That's right. God is spirit. Yeah. That move on man and move in man. Thank God so man can live for him and stand up for him. And then God reveals himself to man and woman. That's right. Thank God and teach them how to serve him, him. and only him and no one else. That's right. That's why we bow to no man. That's right. We don't bow to no man. No. The Pope come to Pittsburgh, you'll find the mayor, the governor, and everybody bow to him. Yeah. You have paid me to bow to his red shoes to save my life. That's right. We bow to no man. That's right. 
We bow to God Almighty. Amen. Listen at this now. Still in Proverbs chapter, chapter 14. Verse. Proverbs chapter 14 and verse 12. Listen. There is a way. There's a way. Which seemeth right unto a man. It's your way. Hmm. Is it a seem right way? It seemeth right. Or is it the right way? You can show people what's in the scriptures and show it right under their nose. Amen. And they'll still say, I don't believe that or Amen. don't mean that. Right. Show it right in their nose. That's right. Look at the many ways, the many ways. I was in India, down there working on the Hindu nation. Mm -hmm. Thousands waked up to walk with the word of God, but I was fortunate to visit a Hindu temple, and somebody said, you should respect all religions. Man, you must have lost your mind. Amen. I don't respect nobody's religion. The only thing I respect is what God believes. That's right. I ain't obligated to respect, respect the religion of men. No. The religion of men is what got the people lost. That's right. The religion of men is what got the people confused. That's right. The religion of men is what got people dead. Dead. That's right. They become more dedicated and loyal to man. And if you got a mind to leave that religion, then the leader of that religion will put a head out on you. <laughs> yes, he will. Have you killed? Have you murdered? And people are so dedicated to that garbage, they go killed in the name of that religion, professing That's that they're doing God's a service. That's right. Stay ahead of me and follow me real good. Still in Proverbs 14 and verse 12. They kill thinking they're doing God of service. That's right. And that is written. That's written. There's many people that are murdered in the name of some religion. Lost their mother. Lost their sisters. Lost their brothers. Lost their fathers. Lost their friends. In the name of some religion. Think of it. How people can be so blind in the book of Saint and John. so loyal to a religion until your leader said, go kill that man. That's right. Go kill your own mother. Oh, yes. Go kill your own father. He left our religion. Now you got to kill him and prove that you're faithful to me. That's right. That's right. And they wonder why I preach this hard. Yes. Oh, yes. I want to wake the world up. That's right. And let them know you're doing it wrong. St. John chapter 16, we'll start at verse 1. Listen. These things have I spoken unto you that you should not be offended. You see, some folks, they, they leave a religion, and then the people of that religion are told, don't speak to them no more. That's right. Don't talk to them no more. Oh, yeah. They go home, mother don't speak to them, father don't speak to them. Mm -hmm. Their own sons and daughters are forbidden to speak to them. Why? They're outcast now. That's right. They're not of that religion. You're so blind and devil deceived, God knows. St. John chapter 16 now at verse 2. Listen. They shall put you out of the synagogue. What? They shall put you out of the synagogue. Jesus, who was the Messiah, mm -hmm. which was the manifestation of God in flesh was instructing his apostles. That's right. And he told the apostles what? They shall put you out of the synagogue. Oh, they're going to put you out of the temple. Yea, the time cometh. The time cometh. That whosoever killeth you. Listen at this. That whosoever killeth you. Kill you. Will think that he doeth God's service. The time That's cometh. written. That's right. That's right. And who's the ones that go to jail? Not the leader. No. The blind, ignorant, dumb followers. And these things will they do you. know, like you. drug dealers. Yeah. You out there selling drugs for the kingpin, he don't go to jail. You get caught. That's right. That's true. You get caught, you go to jail, he just sit back with his greasy fingers, continue to eat Kentucky Fried Chicken. That's right. By you rot in jail. Oh, yes. That the same way with religion. Oh, yes. These men send their followers to put hits out on ex-followers. Yeah. And they do it in the name of their religion. And the Bible says they're thinking they're doing God's a service. Yea, the time cometh that whosoever Get killeth chapter you. chapter verse again. St. John chapter 16 and verse whoever 2. kill you will think that he doeth God's service. Think he's doing God's will. And these things will they do unto you. These things will they do unto you. Because they have not known the Father nor me. Meaning they don't know God. That's right. And they don't know the Son of God, the Messiah, 
Christ Jesus, That's right. Redeemer of humanity. That's right. Don't know him. Don't know him. Don't have no idea who he is. That's right. And you got people like this all over, oh, serving Lord. time in jail right now, murdering people in the name of religion. That's right. All right, go back to where you were, son. Back in Isaiah chapter 35 and at verse 8. Listen. And an highway shall be there. Pittsburgh. A highway is here now. Amen. What way are you following? That's right. What way do you believe? Hmm. What did your pastor tell you? Yeah. What did your rabbi tell you? What did your minister tell you? That's right. What are you being taught? That's right. Who are you bowing to? Hmm. Who are you serving? That's it. What kind of religion? What kind of church is it? That's right. Some folks say, I'm going to church today. Big deal. Roaches go to church. Mm -hmm. That's why it's hard to get rid of them. Amen. What kind of church is it? <laughs> what kind is it? That's it. You're a Catholic? Hail Mary, the mother of God. You's a liar. That's God right. ain't got no mother. That's right. Mary ain't never been the mother of God. She was the mother of the Son of God, servant of God, that body of flesh and blood that came into the world for a sacrifice for the world. That's it. God is without mother. Without mother. Yeah, yeah, In the book yeah, of Hebrews. Yeah, this. Hebrews chapter 7 and verse 3. What do I? Without father. Without father. Without mother. Without mother. Without descent. He have no descent. Having neither, neither beginning, beginning, of days, beginning of days nor end of life. You have no beginning and no ending. Man, you God. That's God. So I want everybody here to check up on your religion. That's it. Evaluate it. Look at what you profess. I want to take you to school tonight. That's you right. can jump and shout next year. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't need to jump and shout if you're going to jump and shout your way into hell. Amen. Think of it. You've been giving money all these years, supporting a religion that the Bible ain't never said it exists. That's right. Never said it. Never. You've never. been faithful, singing in it. You women been cooking sweet potato pies in it. Making macaroni and cheese dishes, pound cake. That's right. Yeah, <laughs> go ahead, take God. You only can sell that cake but so, so much. 35 cents, one dollar, two dollars, five dollars. The, the slice don't get no bigger. That's right. Having camp meetings, going around the neighborhood, giving out tracks with the preacher. Giving out tracks. Never at no time. <laughs> Did anybody stop you mm -hmm. and ask you, is your religion in that book? Right. That's what makes me stop men and women right in their track. That's right. After you done shouting and sweating and falling out on the floor and folks throw a blanket on you like you dead on arrival. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. What? Now in the book of Isaiah chapter 34 and verse 16. What did he say? Seek ye out of Seek the book of the Lord. ye out. Of the book of the Lord. Of the Lord's book. And read. <laughs> Go and take God. Hallelujah. What shall we do? And read. Read it. Read. Give chapter and verse again, Sam. Isaiah chapter Go 34 and verse God. 16. Do you hear this? Seek ye out of the Seek book of the Lord. ye out of, of the, the book, book of, of the, Lord. the Lord. And read. Read it. And no one of these shall fail. <laughs> Hallelujah. That's what I'm asking you to do. I do Baptist? It. Read. You read. Methodist, you Presbyterian, do what? Read. Seek you read it. That's it. You Pentecostal, non-denominational, Muslim, Mormon, five percenters. Do what? Read. Say, can you read it? Read. Hallelujah. Go right to your Bible. Hallelujah. See, did anybody in the Bible profess to be a Hebrew Israelite? Go to the Bible and do what? Read. See, did anybody profess to be a Muslim? Do what? Read. Seek ye out of the book of the, the Lord. The Bible says, search the scriptures. Search the scriptures. For in them you think ye have. think ye have eternal life. That's right. Search it. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I don't care nothing about how black you are, Hallelujah. how white you are. Read. Read. See, see out. Listen, read. Read. And see what God only saved black folk. Go ahead, man. Read. Read. And see what God only saved white folk. Read. Read. That's right. And see, is that teaching in here? Read. Hallelujah. 
What have God said? All nations right. shall flow unto, unto it. it. All nations. Many people shall go and say, Come ye. Come ye. Let us go up That's to it. the mountain of the Lord's house, Hallelujah. to the house of the God of Hallelujah. Jacob, and he right. shall teach us of his ways. His ways. Not they going to teach us That's of right. their ways. That's right. He, he. one going to do it. That's right. Oh, I love that scripture. Read that again. Seek ye out of Israel. Chapter and verse again. Isaiah chapter 34 and verse 16. Glory to God. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. That's what you do. You got your Bible. Seek. That's the book of the Lord. Yeah. Seek. The scriptures is the book of the Lord. That's right. And the scriptures is giving you clear advice. Seek ye out of the Stop book. Stop going along just to get along. That's right. Your soul is at stake. That's right. This is a heaven or hell journey. Amen. You either going to die right or die wrong. That's right. Hallelujah. Are you listening to what I'm telling you? Isaiah chapter 34 and verse 16. That's what? Seek ye out. Seek ye out. Of the book of the Lord. Of the Lord's book. And read. Read it. Read. Hallelujah. Read. Read. Hallelujah. Where the disciples were evangelicals. Read. That's right. Where there was non-denominationals. Read. Read. Where they were Episcopalians. Read. Read. Hallelujah. Read it. Read. Where they were Christian scientists. Read it. That's right. Where their religion was Scientologists. That's Read right. it. Read it. Seek it where out. there was Protestant or Episcopalians or African Methodist Episcopal. That's right. Read it. Read it. Hallelujah. If you cannot read it in that book, dump it. That's right. That's right. You're going to be loyal to something some man started. Amen. But somebody said, you loyal to Christianity. You must not have been listening to me long. No. My religious belief is not Christianity. No, no. At all. At all. You don't find the religion in the Bible called Christianity. No. You find Christian in the Bible. Christians in there was first called Christians at a place called Antioch. Yeah. A Christian is a person who act like Christ. That's right. A Christianity is a religion that came from hell. That's right. Jesus ain't never come and told you he started a religion called Christianity. No. This is what I advise you to do. Do seek, what? Seek ye out of the book seek of the Lord. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. And read. And read. Can you find a religion called Christianity? That's right. Read it. Read. Hallelujah. Don't be loyal to it and dedicate to it, shouting to it, falling all out behind the chairs, knocking people over, That's tearing right. their dress, ripping their pants. That's right. <laughs> Read it. Read. That's what you do. Amen. Read it. Amen. You go to these churches and being dedicated five, ten, fifteen, twenty years, your mother raised you up in these churches. That's right. Read it. Read. That's right. The reason why these preachers are able to duke you, con you, and manipulate you because they know you don't read the Bible. That's right. So the preacher tell you, believe what I say, but not what I do. Liar! Lying. That's right. Believe what God says. That's it. And do what God says. That's right. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord. Let's tie that in with what Jesus taught us. Search the scriptures. Search the scriptures. Search the scriptures. That's it. Seek ye out the book of the Lord and, and read it. Read. That sounds good. Amen. Thank God when I read the scriptures and make my teaching justifiable and make my teaching all coincide with what God believes. That's it. Because the book of scriptures let us know what God believes and what God don't believe. That's right. What pleases God, what displeases God. That's it. When man try to make two more with the one God, mm -hmm. I look at the scriptures and I read it. It says, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God is one. He's one. They try to make two more with them. That's I right. can look and read the book of Isaiah. Mm -hmm. There's no God before me. There's right. no God with no me. God with me. There's no God that shall be after me. After me. And then God say, "Yea, I know not, not any. any." That's right. And if God, who know all things, don't know no other God but Him, but him. and you say you know other gods, why should I believe you? That's right. What man walking here smarter than God? Amen. Who's deeper than God? Amen. Who's broader than God? These men walk around with some little degree they got for some old college. That's man, right. God knowledge is longer than that. That's right. The greatest wisdom in the world 
is the wisdom of the Most High God. That's right. Yeah. St. John chapter 5 and verse 39. What does it say, son? Search the scriptures. Go and say God. Hallelujah. Do what? Search the scriptures. You know what had messed men up? They searched everything but the scriptures. But the scriptures. That's what messed men up. That's right. They searched everything but the scriptures. That's right. And when you bring people to scriptures, oh, uh, um, I don't believe that. <laughs> Bible been changed. The scriptures, God, they say this, God's word been changed too many times. Now let me give you some knowledge. You can take this book and all the Bibles in the world, all the book of scriptures in the world, and burn them all up. But you have never got rid of God's word. That's right. Do you get me? That's right. 